So this is the um, experiment with the paper clip floating on water and here it floats on water. And over here there is soapy water in here and I can try as hard as I want to and it's never going to float. There you go, never is going to float. Okay, this one is the capillary tube. And the water, this is probably very hard to see. There's another one here. Um, it goes up, oh, about a centimeter or so. Hold on. Yeah, maybe half a centimeter it goes up, and, and that probably is very hard to see. Let's see. Other experiments I have. This is the, and you can film from the top here. So I have a cork floating on water. And now I'm going to depress it with this diving bell and we can see, maybe on film, that it's being depressed all the way into the water. And that's how diving bell works. Worked. I can also do it the opposite way. Fill the beaker here with water and then pull up the cork and you can see it's on top of the other surface, uh, water surface here uh, with water of course being in the beaker. This one is the lung model and there are a couple of small balloons here and there's a hole up here and when I pull this out you can see that the balloons inflate as I pull out the membrane. This one is a Cartesian diver and I have to press this pretty hard and then you can see that it sinks. You perhaps also can see that as I press it pretty hard that the air on top of the water filled bottle that that volume is decreasing due to my pressure and then if you were able to see the eyedropper here a little bit closely right now the water level is about two-thirds up but if I press on here then the water level inside the eyedropper is going to go all the way up this one here the connected syringes when I press on the big one, then the small one is going up, maybe, oh boy, oh, there it goes up, okay. But it's pretty hard to do, and when I press on the small one, you can see that I easily can depress this one here. And again, pushing on the big one, the small plunger is going up very slowly, but I have to exert a lot of force and again on a small one really easy okay, and I think I just got one more right this one here so I have marbles in here and so these are the water filled glass jars and there are marbles in there and there are these floaters and when I turn this one well the marbles are going to the outside and the floaters are going to the inside Next experiment, this one here. You can come closer if you want, or if you could. So I'm going to light the candle, and this pan is full with water. And now I'm going to put this test tube over the candle. And I believe you can see that that the water rose, and in fact it rose so much that it that the candle is now floating on top of the water about half an inch up or even more. This one here. So I have this hose here inside the water and now I'm gonna plug the hose on one end and I'm gonna immerse it into the other beaker and sometimes this may not work is right now okay I'm gonna try it one more time and if it then doesn't work I'm just gonna skip this one let's see okay there's just some airs coming out right now okay now I'm gonna plug it and now the water is not running out, so let's skip it because I think I'm just wasting too much uh, camera time here. Okay, I'm going to fill this one up. 
and this one actually goes the same as the hydrostatic experiment that you did. There we go. And I have water spouting out from three different levels and it's easy to see that on the lower one it's really far, on the middle one it's less distance than on the top one. It was only a little bit distance, of course there's no water on top anymore. Okay, now for the other one, if you could come around and film this one over here. I think, I think you have to come around to show this one. But I have to turn it my way. Okay, I'm going to make a soap bubble and I'm going to make a big one and a small one. At least that's what I try. Okay, and now I plug this one and now we're going to see what happens is that the small one gets smaller and the large one actually did grow. Okay, and I think that's what I got.